people, when they feel like they're being bent, feel like they're breaking. You're not breaking, you're just bending. There's a resiliency that God builds in a person as they're going through wildernesses, weary seasons. He's building resiliency. And you will find yourself bending and you're like, oh my God, I'm tired. But you notice that you're not breaking. He says, be not weary and well-doing. Weariness is a mindset. <laughs> when, you, when, you, when soldiers go through training, the goal is to reprogram the mind to take on more burdens, to take on more strain so that it can be able to, when pressed in the future, be more resilient. So when you have a mindset of weariness, you're going to feel more weary. Don't get me wrong. You're going to feel weary. But he says, do not be weary in well-doing. If Now, that's, that, that's key. Well-doing. Are you weary in poor doing or weary in well-doing? There's two types of weariness. If you're weary in poor doing, then you got to take things off your life, off the plate of your life. When you're weary in poor doing, you got to say, what decisions am I making? Why am I too tired? You got to, we, we all got to learn how to be more balanced. We got to say, if I'm weary in poor doing, then I got to stop doing things poorly. I got to make sure I'm dividing my time. Act. I got to make sure I'm getting enough rest. If sometimes our weariness is our fault. But if you're weary in well-doing, and you know this is what God is telling you, he says you will reap, reap, keyword, reap, meaning do not get weary in the planning and the raining and the sun season of, of a plan. He says in due season, or you will reap if you reap, means that there is a guaranteed reward from what you have sold previously. So in order not to have a weary mindset, you have to be focused that I will reap. There's something powerful about I will reap. That there is a due season. But I got to make sure that the faint not part of scripture is my responsibility. He says, do not be weary and well doing for in due season you will reap if you faint not. The devil wants us to faint in well doing. Fainting means allowing that weary mindset to cripple us, allowing that weary mindset to make us feel like, man, why am I doing this? And all of a sudden you faint or give up or forsake going forward. When you weary and poor doing, remove things off your plate, go back to the drawing board, use wisdom <clears throat> and regroup your stewardship. But if it's well doing, reading, fasting, praying, waiting, serving, giving in a balanced way, Focus on I will reap and in due season. In due season and I will reap and you focus on not fainting. That's the, that's, that's the fundamental foundational way to ensure to correct in excuses or, uh, or to um, uh, overcome weary seasons. Next question. Hope that helped. Be weary. If it's poor doing, remove it. If it's well doing, keep pressing.